What's this one? Oh my god, Nick and this is a pterodactyl. Pterodactyl, and what's this one? I'm a triceratops. Yeah. And the yellow one. Look at this. It's like, this is my bed. Wherever you are, that's where I want to be. All it took was a laugh and that soft sunset. Big blue eyes looked up inside. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Faye. Good morning, Liv. So cool that you're over here because you're not in school. Normally when um, the Johnsons come over, it's just pain because Liv's in school, but it's sore break. Yay. Uh -huh. And I'm in first grade. You're in first grade now, <coughs> and you look kind of like a hillbilly because all your teeth are missing. <coughs> Show me your teeth. My mom put this Wait, what? Yeah. That one fell out that was bleeding everywhere at lunch? Yeah. Mom pulled it out. <laughs> Ew, but did it hurt? Uh -uh. Aw, that's so cool. So anyways, we are having a fun day. The kids are playing. Finn is down for a nap, and I'm actually getting ready to it, film it can, a video. So, it, it that's what we're doing. They're so cute. You guys go play in Ollie's room, but don't wake up Finn. Got it? Good morning, guys. I need your honest opinion. What should I do with my office? I just don't know what to do. It has become the room where we put things when we don't know where to put them anymore. So like, I have so much old tech gear and cameras. I don't know, I'm just not feeling it. And I wanna be able to hang out in here and like do things and be productive and play video games and stuff. And I just don't know how to organize everything. I feel like I just have to get rid of a ton of things. I just have so many like, random batteries and cords and I feel like I need someone who's like good with tech stuff to come over and just help me. <laughs> Tell me what you guys think of this idea. I was thinking about taking down my New York mural. I've had it there for like a little over a year now. But what if I took this all down and I did a Polaroid mural and any Polaroids we take, we just do sticky tack and we just fill the entire wall with Polaroids. Would that be cool or do you think that'd be stupid? I don't know. I'm kind of at a loss right now with my office just because I don't ever hang out in here and I want to hang out in here and play video games and work and stuff. <sighs> but I can't. Check out this bright sunny day we're having though. It's so hot, you guys. I think the June gloom is leaving. It's becoming summer now, so we're definitely gonna have to get in the pool. Oh, also, I don't know if we ever showed you guys this, but I'm sure this will be in Missy's backyard tour, because she did a house tour, but she didn't do any of the yards. So I'm sure she'll do like a backyard tour, but we have like some cool little seating areas out here by the fire. And then um, we also have like a a little day bed out here, which we literally just bought pillows for. We have some cool pillows out here on the day bed now, but as you can see, it's right in the sun. So you kind of have to wait for the sun to go above the house before you can actually hang out in here. Holy cow, it is hot. We have to jump in that pool. Okay, so we have been swimming in the pool and tragedy has struck and I feel so bad, you guys. What's wiggling around, babe? Oh, oh, I I've see it. I've never been stung before and it hurts so bad. It's Missy's very first bee sting. Look like, at that. Like, do you see it? Oh, <laughs> it still stings, it hurts. Look at it, it's all red. I'm sorry. Oh, that was so bad. Okay, so I went like this, I went to like lift myself up, and I pull my arm away, and there's absolutely a bee sticking on. You stick! Oh, thanks. He got you a stick. Oh, to get the bee. Let's see the culprit. Where are you, culprit? Hopefully he's dead now. That thing can cause so much freak. I don't know if I've ever been in someone's face by a bug. Oh, yeah. Like a tiny little bug. Mm. Mosquitoes bite, but you don't really feel it. They just itch. This hurts. Yeah. Like, I, my arm's broken. I can't even use it. <laughs> I feel so bad. I've been stung a couple of times, but I haven't been recently, I don't think. I pulled it off, and then the stinger was still attached, and it was so freaking painful! I just need to kill it. Sorry, babe. Yeah. That is a yucky bug. It oh, is a yucky bug. bug. It's a yucky one. Yeah, it's yucky bug. Ollie, Mama's so sad, can you give her a hug? Okay. She's so sad. 
Look at Mama's bee sting. You want to give it a kiss? <laughs> Just there. Yes. True, true tragedy has struck. Oh my god, there's another bee! There's another bee! It was coming right for me. That one wanted me. Yeah, bee stings suck, you guys. I feel so bad for Missy. She literally tells me all the time how she's never been stung before, and I'm like, well, you know it's coming, right? If you've never been stung before, it's definitely coming. Ugh, I feel so bad. I don't think any of the boys have been stung, but we just know that that day is coming, especially since we spent a lot of time outside, around the pool, where the bees like to come, and they'll like drink the pool water. So it's definitely something we have to be watchful of, which is definitely a bummer. All right, you guys, we are done swimming. The kids are still having a blast, so I decided to make some food poolside. So, that's what <laughs> all this mess is from. I actually bought a panini press, and I made paninis, and they look so good. It has mozzarella cheese, basil, pesto, chicken, tomatoes, all that yummy stuff, so we're gonna eat out here. You guys have to be careful of bees, okay? They're yeah, everywhere. There's a ton, we literally, we, she just freaked out because she saw one flying over. I told you. I told Secret though, if you see a bee, you just go under the water. Oh, I thought you're supposed to splash it. No, no. Oh. splash it. I always splash it. I always splash it. <laughs> Don't splash it. I splash it. Maybe that's why I got angry and got you. By the way, look what it's been doing. Oh, it's getting worse. Dude. Oh yeah. It's literally swelling. And it's, it's red. It hurts. Uh. It hurts. Like I know I freaked out a little bit, but I think it was completely valid. Yeah. It hurts. <laughs> I do feel bad about it, like freaking the kids out a little yeah. bit. Yeah. But it hurts. Oh, I, I did not. Looks so bad. I always got so mad at people who like get freaked out about yeah. me. I'm like, oh my gosh. <laughs> now you know. But hey, you look beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. How's that? This is very good. I made paninis, you guys, and I am so excited to eat this. It looks so good. I did the copycat one from Corner Baker. Corner Baker. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. That is amazing. That'll cure your bee sting, babe. Probably not, but it'll taste good. Okay, I'm broken. I can't even use it. <laughs> hey, Finn, is there anything better than cold pizza after swimming? I don't think so, huh? Oh, you got an orange? He's like, that's pretty good. Look how he eats oranges, you guys. He eats them like an apple. <laughs> It's so funny. You got some lunch? How was swimming? Whoa, that's a pretty cool robot gun. Wow! We are actually doing something fun tonight with the family. I am packing. And we're gonna be doing something actually probably a little bit more fun tomorrow. This is a little bit of a hint. <laughs> and we are super excited. I'm just getting the boys all packed up. I've got their pajamas and their clothes and me. And it is just for one night, so it's gonna be really easy packing. So I ended up jumping in the pool again today. And look what happened, you guys. I got hurt. Exactly when Missy got hurt. <laughs> I think he did it on purpose. <laughs> it's like our matching wounds. Look at that. Oh, it, it was so brutal. bad. Oh, it hurts so bad. It. it looks, it's like a burn almost, right? Yeah, so what happened was I was going down the slide and I kind of like hopped and then my arm got stuck forward and then it smashed into the rocks as I was going down. Ugh. It, did yeah. you know it was going to be that bad? No, I definitely bad? hurt. It definitely hurt. Yeah. But then it didn't start really hurting or showing up like this for a while. How do we both get oh, hurt? No. Same arm, Rotten same luck. thing. I just packed the thermometer, because I always bring one when we go with the boys. And I checked myself and I did not have a fever, which I knew. But then I checked my arm and it said I have a very bad fever. It said I have 102 and it flashed red and it went beep, 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 beep. That's, I, pfft, this is crazy. Oh, it hurts so bad. Hey Ollie, what? you want to see something really gross? Mm. Look at, I got owie on my arm. Mm -hmm. Don't touch it, don't touch it, it hurts. Isn't that scary looking? Yeah. Is this, that you got scraped? Yeah, I got a little scrape right there. Isn't that sad? Did you just do that? You did it on the slide. That's why you gotta be careful, okay? Mm -hmm. If you wanna see it on the camera, you gotta show it there. Alright, so before we take off for the night, I thought I would show you my little chickens. I'm pretty excited because I let all the chicks out <laughs> and Pam out for the last two days. 
and they have been getting along great. I'm so excited. I know that I'm sure there was a little bit of like scuff just so, between like Pam and some of the chickens or some of the chicks, but to be honest, it's been great. They have all been just hanging out with each other and scratching together and they're just like so cute. Plus, they're now just like at the size where they can literally not only run so fast, they can basically fly. They will fly like through this coop um, right now and they just seem a little bit more sturdy like if they were to get into a fight they would just run these chickens wouldn't even be able to catch up with them so i feel really good about them i feel like they're uh pretty much old enough now to just be with the other chickens so we're gonna be taking this um apart over the next like day and they'll be set free into the coop because everyone's getting along thank you guys where are all of them <laughs> they still love hiding in her and they like literally i think there might be two. Oh, there's a couple over there one, two, three, four, five, and there's another one. I'm also pretty certain at this point that I have two roosters at least, which is definitely a bummer. I think this one, Moana, is a boy, which is definitely a bummer. I'm not sure about these two because I don't really know the difference this early on. And then one of my reds. We have Ariel and Anna. They're two reds and they're both very different. One is definitely smaller, one's bigger, one has like a big tail poofed out and the other one just has like a little curved butt. So kind of sad if they're roosters, they tend to be mean. So I have a feeling that not all of them will be, will be able to keep, but we will see. Maybe I'm wrong. All right, guys, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Be good. Nope, 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 you're good. You got lots of food. You don't need to leave. And see you later. <laughs> and we are all packed. We got water for the boys, shoes. What are these? Yeah. Oh, he's, that's not Luna. Can you say shoes? <laughs> and now we are loading up the car. It's time to go. And you got your jammies on, because you're going to sleep. Oh, what are these? Say shoes. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty close. Yeah, what are these? Shoes. Luna, are we going bye bye? Well, you're staying here. You're gonna have fun with Karma and Jimmy. Come here, Luna. Come here. <laughs> Luna. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Did you miss her? Go see her. <laughs> She's like ah. Look at these boys. So we just checked into our hotel and they gave them puppies. Yeah. You guys got your own puppies? Been so happy. <laughs> it's so cool. It has been a long drive into LA, but we made it. Are you petting your puppy? That's me. This looks like Karma and that looks like Luna. That's true, it does. Yeah, I do. Uh, we remember. Do you remember? <laughs> yeah. <I> remember <laughs> when you were a baby too. <laughs> These boys are so cute. They're in such a good mood now. Now that we're not in the car, but we just got to our room. We're just staying here one night, and then we're doing something super fun in the morning. But babe, look at this. I did not know we had this. Whoa! Careful with your puppies. Hold them tight. Look, there's a pool down here. There is a pool down there, huh? There's a hot tub and a big pool. This is crazy. I don't think we've ever had a view like this down here. Uh, that's literally LA. I know. Look at all those buildings, Ollie. Yeah, but why did you have a band-aid? Oh, I have band-aids because remember I got hurt. Really? <laughs> yeah. Seriously, look at that view. That's so cool. Sun's going down. It's almost nighttime. And honestly, it's almost time to put these kids to bed. You like your puppy? Ah, he's licking me. <laughs> hey, Ollie. What? They just finished setting up your bed. You want to go see it? It's so cute. Yeah. Come look at your bed. They just turned the couch into a little bed for Ollie. And it has dinosaurs. It's, it's, puppy. it's like they knew, Ollie. Yeah. Can you name all the different types of dinosaurs? A raptor. Yeah, there's a raptor. And what's this one? A Spinosaurus. Spinosaurus? No, I think that's a Stegosaurus. What's this one? A Myonic and this is a Pterodactyl. Pterodactyl? And what's this one? I'm a Triceratops. Yeah. And a Yamaha. He's like, this is my bed. Scoot over, Finn. Look, at he's actually scooting over right now. Aww. Why are our kids so cute? I know. Finn, is Ollie's bed comfy? <laughs> he's actually almost ready. We did get a crib for him, but... He might be ready for something like that. He's so cute. 
<laughs> We've just been hanging out in the room waiting for the bed to get set up. We have Boss Baby, which is always fun, huh? Yeah, I love when hotels have movies that you can watch in the room that aren't even like out of theaters yet. That's always fun. All right, you guys, hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, be sure to click that thumbs up button. <laughs> Check out the iCard in the corner of the screen to watch more fun videos from us. And we will see you manana where we have a fun day to do. So don't miss tomorrow's vlog. You ready for tomorrow's vlog? Yeah. Yeah? You excited? Don't do thumbs down. Do thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Yay! Thanks for watching. Ollie, what do you say? Yeah.